So I've been trying to take the weekends off. And this was the first weekend that I really went for it. And having that um, set up where I, I try to work eight hours during the weekdays and then have the weekends off. See if it works better when I'm forcing. I'm the one forcing myself to do it. Uh, but we'll see. So this is... I'm back. Um, I'm going to... It should be a, a f pretty easy um, project. What he wants is a custom shirt uh, uh, just based on this uh, illustration. I'll pull it up in a second. And yeah, not going to mess with the thingies in his hands. He didn't say anything about that, so we'll just make the shirt. And then he can do whatever he wants with the thingies. X vertices. Oh, this is funny. So it's like made in a few different sections. Seeing the mesh on avatars like this is interesting too. Because they're low poly. So like figuring out how people will make the shapes without... Tons without tons of polygons. Yeah, whatever. Shit tons of polygons. <laughs> I was like, uh, who cares? Uh, all right, we don't need that either. All right. Um. Yeah, at least like this thing's got this crazy whatever is going on there. But uh, in the end, I'm not sending him the avatar. I'm going to make the shirt. Uh, oh, no, that's not what I want. No. Oh, I see. I need to go back to the mesh. Okay. Um. Yeah. So then he can put it on. Uh, well, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, he wanted me to make it, so I'm going to make it, and he'll get somebody else to put it on. Because I have a lot of commissions that I haven't been able to get to because of uh, my laptop and the, the, it, it being broken. Um, so yeah, like I started doing these videos last week because I just needed something to like feel better and doing something productive helped and I really liked it uh, so it's a lot in the same today I don't feel good busted my knee at the reunion well it was after the reunion was all done and I like was wearing wedges which I never do I don't even wear shoes. I don't even wear socks. It's been a year and a half. Now I do sometimes when I go out, but I mean at home. You just don't need to. So walking around in wedges, like dressing up and having a reason to to wear something nicer than I have been for months. <laughs> it was fun, but they are not practical shoes. So I was walking through the parking lot and I just like took a dive and took it all on my knee. And it's just really sore now. It's like, what, Monday? So... It's been a couple days. He's just been limping around. Um, yeah, he wants the white undershirt and then this. Does he? Oh, he already has a headband, I guess. And then the 
messes up things. So I'll start with the white undershirt. Yeah, uh, overall the reunion was, uh, it was great. It was uh, an excuse to go out and do something after so long, which I appreciated. Um, but yeah, not in the best physical condition because of that tum tumble. Oh well. <laughs> but um yes, as always making stuff making stuff is my anti pain. Um Basically going to like make up his shoulders and stuff, so you know. So you can do it like specific vertices, you can like click all and then shift click to unselect them and then it's not going to do that thing in the middle that keeps happening, keep having to fix it. I'm hungry. I haven't had breakfast yet. Literally I rolled out of bed and had to like deal with server issues. Which is fine. And then. But it's not like. A productive way to wake up. I need to have a better. Um, like. Daily schedule as well. Oh. I got. So I mentioned in one of my videos. Uh, one of the people that I. Was really helpful and um, learning about avatar creation was, was Ether and his research and his documentary series. Um, and we've been friends since I like reached out to him and was like, hey, I also study this strange world of VR chat asset making and avatar making uh, this, this niche art world and he was like cool buddy and I don't know it's been like one of those friendships where you can just like you pop up randomly every so often so I went into his stream last night and chatted a little bit with him uh through his twitch stream <laughs> which is funny but you know you can run into people any any way you like in the internet I, um, yeah, so I surprised him by popping in, and it was really nice. But uh, there wasn't too much going on. It was just like a chill chat, and look at this. He showed me a couple of his avatars, which was fun, and I showed him some of my work, too, and he was like, ah, he, it's like a nice little kiki. Yeah, but, <clears throat> I don't know, maybe I could make that part of my schedule. It's like, I'm starting to feel more social again. Like, it's crazy. Like, the, so the, the everything's starting to open up here. And, 
I mean, the mask mandate has been lifted in my area for quite a few days now. Hmm. I'm like given buttons or something. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, and I guess, well, I don't know. I haven't been keeping up with, uh, what you can and can't do because I was just like I'm just gonna stay in my home until uh, things are different because like the we've been getting this the story that like oh we'll open up uh, in a month or something since last February so because I have the ability to just like be here and do my digital work I I just thought for uh, for for my safety but like the safety of for the most part it's like my grandparents and uh, immunocompromised friends of family you know I I wanted to keep them safe because I don't I don't think I was ever at risk personally um, but it was about keeping other people safe for me that was my motivation people asked me like oh so you're afraid blah 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 and I was like nah I'm just like I've s sort of like paid attention to what to do in uh, massive disease times, like what worked in the past, you know, staying home, uh, not spreading, <laughs> not spreading it risk management all that sort of stuff what I thought was common sense but I guess maybe not quite so much and then some people are just like I don't care I want to like live my life and I don't want all these restrictions all this all that and I think like everyone but the ones like purposefully spreading it were valid responses kind of like whatever live your life I can't like control you or dictate you any more than you like yelling that I'm letting my rights be infringed by wearing a mask is affecting me so I'm just glad it's like steps are finally feeling like they're being taken like actual something's actually happening instead of just being told oh we're going to open up oh it'll be over this that like I never believed that because it wasn't really based on anything it was what I figured uh, as much about it was that it was just crowd control to make sure people didn't panic which is important as well Thanks, government, for making our lives less panicky, I guess. Ugh. But, I digress. Yeah, Ooh, cute little microphone. wonder if he sings. I don't really know much about this player. I uh, got the commission through a friend has like a commissions channel and he pinged me in there and I was like hmm what's going on and he was like this person wants a shirt I was like hey. shirts no problem so the other reference pictures he sent me were quite a bit different 
and I'm glad that he got this uh, art commissioned, but like they didn't do the bottom of the shirt. Uh, all right, that's fine. What I'm gonna do? We'll just do the top and then detail out the bottom, the white, the button up. From based on what you can actually see. Interesting UVM map too. Size like what? What is happening? Oh, why? 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 Yeah, just make him tall. Make him tall. Get him spook. Okay. Well, it's like a half seashore. Come on, Indian, come on, and then we rock bottom, bottom to the rock. So, like, need lotion. I'm just not, not having my best Monday. It's okay. Come on, let me dry my hands to rock bottom, bottom to rock. Sweet. Right, now that's clipping. And that's fine. And extrude. And extrude. And then, alright. This is uh, one of the fun things is seeing the whole uh, transformation process, you know, like transformation of materials. In the beginning, there was cube. And it was good. Oh, yeah, definitely. So this is something I'm excited to show you. So I've been using the proportional editing, as you saw, but when you put proportional editing on, plus connected only, like, uh, here, I'll show you what happens with it off. So, yeah, all sorts of naughty things. Uh, connected only means all of these are going to just affect only only affect and be affected by uh that dude the whatever is like the edges and the vertices that that they are connected to yeah Pretty simple, pretty self-explanatory, but 
it is <clears throat> like an awesome feature of the proportional editing tool. Big fan, big snaps. So even actually to increase optimization, I could delete once I have like all this, I could delete those planes that you don't really see. Um, it would help a lot. Increase optimization and uh honestly basically take care of clipping because the nature of this avatar is like safe for work so what you see in game and everything is just going to be like the clothes the clothes make up the avatar's actual body because there's nothing underneath it's just clothes and that makes it really easy to like you you don't have to deal with clipping as much you can get a higher like level of optimization with that too it's pretty sweet i don't know why more people don't just have safe for work avatars because they want to party i guess it's not my business Oh, I can't do that. Uh, okay. I don't care. That's fine. It doesn't affect me. Just wanted it a little bit. Like so. And then I can also, uh, do the smooth, smooth vertices here. Oops. Uh, definitely want to make sure this collar is still like a collar. Uh huh. something more like that and then that'll be that'll be that shape um, we need this to be a different shape as well and I want yeah yeah I don't even know if we need all that. <coughs> Gotta sneeze, what do I do? Other things. 
Okay. It's looking more like the illustration. I want it like pretty dead on. I can't help it. I think I'll need to eat after this. I'm just really bummed out. And this is not it's not it's not doing the things. It's not giving me dopamine that I need. Don't need any of that. Nothing. Nothing underneath. If we don't see it, it's gone. Gone. You're gone. What's going on over here? A X face. Let's see. So I delete by the faces because, like you saw, I had some vertices that I had uh, chosen. Um, that were still visible because of the way I clicked and I didn't want to delete the vertices. I just wanted to delete uh, the faces that I chose. So you can you can delete by vertices, the X, you can delete by edges, faces, edges and faces, only faces. You can dissolve them, which um, it like squishes them together what does that do yeah it just like dissolves it it's gone and it like collapses the face into one face um edges i don't know i haven't really like done a lot of this stuff uh when you're like retopologizing you have like a want to like get a lower polygon count uh deleting by edge loops is really helpful. The only thing is that um, in a lot of ways it can like mess up your quads and turn things into triangles. But like you don't have to care about that. The only thing quads does is make it easier to edit but triangles aren't impossible to edit. They're you know it's all just up to preference to people's like personal workflow um what oh i copied it oops i didn't mean to press c i meant to press eh. okay i know what i want to do here uh, uh, yes 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 x face Two, three, four, eight. Now, uh, I think, I think that's an X face. Uh, Actually, yeah, we already got it. We already got this.
All right. We need to make it less boxy. Rock bottom, bottom to rock. Rolling, rolling on the ground to rock bottom, bottom to rock. Oh, uh, <laughs> that had an interesting effect on the silhouette. <laughs> yeah, in the picture, he is quite, he's very petite, so definitely going to want to keep that silhouette of petiteness. And his, like, collarbone area is too thick. Ah, get out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um. <clears throat> what I want to do is kind of put uh, uh red and another one, another one. Alright, and switch it over. And there's no texture for those, so it's not showing. Um, I don't care. Glossy. I don't know why I do this. Nobody taught me, so I just do what I want. Ah, give me. I do what works. I guess it doesn't matter. If I only click that to um put an image. So not putting an image I'm just putting some like whatever filler color yeah that's the word I was searching for uh, <clears throat> just putting filler color so that I can show the client the progress and before I get too far into like detailing the design or doing anything like that make sure he's happy with the direction I'm taking it in otherwise it could be like a lot of time a lot of time spent on something that he'll want me to do over anyway or scrap in I'm not about that life time is uh, the most valuable asset ah -ha -ha. okay I think that's that's good about it. On the side. Boom. Boom. <clears throat> oh. Colors are different too. Interesting. I don't know. 
because the one that he sent me, the colors were like this, but color is easy. He wants it black and purple. You'll get it black and purple. Never you mind that. Come on, let me down on you. Hands on rock bottom, bottom to rock. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we do not, we don't, oops, uh, we don't need you, actually, so you're getting the delete. Nice. You're sticking out like that. Ha ha ha. Okay. Tab. Ugh. Yeah, see, there's, like, cute little detail things. I definitely want to, like, make the sleeves more, and then the clothing wrinkles. And then this border. So I'm just going to do it according to the colors in the picture, actually. E um, yeah. Oh, okay. Yay. You know what? I do feel a lot better now. Like, I'm always so surprised at how, like, creating something can get, can make your whole headspace feel, like, different. So. That is... This thingy. So maybe I want to like bring his shoulders down. Something. <laughs> they were kind of down like that. I grabbed it for the app. Is this unnecessary? Uh, that's not necessary. Uh, that is probably not necessary. Hmm. Yeah, it's been a while since I've gotten to do anything on my commissions, and because my laptop's hard drive is completely unrecoverable, I lost a lot of the progress that I had already. So, it was a big, big bummer, but we move right on forward, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 
maybe. Hmm, I don't know. I want him to have more bends. Basically making that shirt shaped arm. Because they said it's going to be his only arm business. And. <sighs> yeah. Like that. Less like a cube. Just trying to just. Oh. All 3D design is just making cubes not look like cubes. No, I'm kidding. There's a lot more to it. But that's what I'm doing. That's, that's what I'm doing right now. Just make this cube not a cube. Alright, and then there's... Where the... Ah! You know, I want it like that. Oh! Nope. Yeah. What? Oh, it's the microphone. Okay. Okay. Ugh. Yeah, we'll end at the edge of the microphone so I don't like figure. I have to figure out how, like, to make this cuff. But I think I'm going to stop here for now and show him the shirt. I could change the colors, too. Oh, and it's off the center. Fun. Fun, fun, fun. Okay. Uh, we'll have to figure that out too. But for now, I'm just going to send him this nice little silhouette and hop off because I still don't have anything in my stomach since I woke up. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. And if you want to see more of my work, join my Discord. Until next time, bye.